Yep. <clears throat> Ooh, welcome everyone to DJ Madness presented by the Sports Gambling Podcast. I'm Sean stacking the money green with my partner picks Ryan Real Money Kramer. What's happening, Kramer Dog? Well, Sean, we have a matchup between former conference rivals, Virginia, my favorite team in the whole world, the, the wannabe <laughs> private school pussies themselves, Virginia Cavaliers. They are headed to Maryland to take on the Terrapins, which of course, Sean is a turtle. Turtle and joining us in studio, college basketball expert and host of the College Experience Podcast, Colby Dan, aka the Dan to Base. The rivalry continues, guys. I'm excited. Indeed. Right now, you can get the line. It's already moved down to minus three and a half. Maryland, Virginia, plus three and a half. Total sitting at 83. Before we get going, Ryan, we have to announce the winner of the three point shootout. And that is Brad Eckhoff. Or the three point challenge for every three point basket that's made, he'll get $10. Cold hard cash courtesy of us. And again, bet on these games live over at mybookie.ag, promo code SGP. I'm rocking. Oh, no. Maryland. We, we have to. I'm sorry. We have to exit out real quick. We had a glitch with the jerseys. That didn't look right. Give us a moment. Okay. Ryan is, Ryan is resetting so we can get the right jerseys in there. But uh, yeah, right now, the line is down to, uh, yeah, Maryland minus three and a half, total sitting at 83. I'm on Maryland minus three and a half. I think on the podcast, what did I have? Did I, did I go under? Uh, yeah, or no, actually, I had over, and I, I'll go over here as well. Over eighty three, the over has been four and zero. Oh. The dogs have been four and zero. Oh. I'm going uh, favorite here, and the over. Colby, which way are you leaning? I'm on the Terps here. I I think the first, you know, it's been all dogs, the you know, since we started this thing. But I think the Terps are the play here, the much more talented team. But one thing that scares me is the way Virginia played coming into this tournament. They're red hot. Tony Bennett doing one of the best coaching jobs of his career. I go on the over too. I'm going to back you up on, on both plays there, buddy. But um, yeah, Kramer, it sh should be a great game. Kramer. I know you're a uh, Virginia tech fan. No way you're back in UVA. You're also on Maryland. The line moved. It was four and a half. Now it's down to three and a half over Whoa. my bookie. Unfortunately I got it at four and a half. <laughs> the private school kids are getting love from the public. So Ryan, are you, uh, you willing to take my over 83 action? Yeah, I'll, whatever, whatever you want to do, bro. All right. I'll take over 83 and Kramer. Any, any thoughts on the game? Uh, I mean, I just think again, this is a game where if the, uh, again, with the jerseys, Sean, should we give it one more shot? We're having all sorts of technical difficulties. Yeah. I don't know. You're the, you're the tech guy. We're going to give it one, give more, it shot. one more shot to load the custom jerseys. It, you know what it is? We should, we let Virginia in the tournament. Yeah, and then that's that's when the uh, that's when things all went haywire. Another thing, though, is uh, Virginia traditionally in the first round has not done good with the uh, the state of Maryland. A little UMBC, not far up the road from uh, College Park, Maryland. So I could see them dropping another uh, opening round game to, to a Maryland school. Yeah, I mean it. It'll be interesting. Maryland is one of those teams that had a lot of momentum things. I mean, again, it would have been nice to see them in the actual tournament. We don't have that option, but we do have the option to watch this great game in DJ madness. The first, I mean, the first couple nights of DJ madness couldn't be more exciting back to back nights with a buzzer beater. Colby, do you see an exciting finish uh, happening this time around? I hope not for my money's <laughs> sake, but, uh, but look, Tony Bennett is a, is a great coach and he's what he's an elite coach in my opinion. And they even have the guy with the blonde hair. I like to call him Cisco Diakite. hashtag enter the dragon. Diakite. Uh, yeah, but, but I mean, Tony Bennett, clearly the coaching advantage goes with the, uh, the, 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 the Wahoos and the Cavaliers here. So uh wouldn't surprise me if it was a one possession game, but hopefully like I said, I think Maryland's a much more talented team. I had Maryland as like a top five most talented team. And in the I know you even year. you even had Maryland uh, going all the way in some of your I, brackets. I, I, I have them winning it all. So uh, Colby's not afraid of taking a big dog. They, and they have upside. I'll say that they definitely are one of the teams that you want to talk about. You want to talk about a team outside that <laughs> one two plus seventeen hundred. I I placed that wager. Man. Oh my goodness! Wow, <laughs> that's pretty awesome. And of course, you can check your bracket, see how you're doing so far. Sportsgamblingpodcast.com. 
in the race for three thousand dollars. The best bracket, of course, we'll get two thousand, three thousand total in prizes presented. Uh, prizes put up by Barking Dog Partners. So excited to get this going once again. The juices are flowing. I'm feeling alive. We're showing the sliders, making sure everything is on the up and up and because this is DJ Madness. And Kramer even pointed it out. He's run a ton of simulations to get you simulation data to set the lines, to set the totals. And it seems like we're getting outliers because, well, first off, one, Washington upset Baylor, but also these games are just so incredibly exciting. And maybe the computer knows that there's millions of fans watching at home, putting it up on their big screen, going nuts, cracking beers, enjoying the My quarantine. My CPU is a neural, <laughs> a neuralist computer, a learning computer. What the, what the fuck was it that wow, look at you call me? My CPU is a neural <laughs> computer, some shit like that. It does Terminator. feel like the right. Terminator. We're termi- <laughs> terminating a learning computer. We're terminating the boredom associated with the quarantine virus. Or here we go, guys. <laughs> Let's go. Tip off here. From the Xfinity Center in College Park, Maryland. Let's just call it uh, Cole Field House. <laughs> All right. Uh, okay. Now, one of the things I want to see is if Maryland can disrupt the tempo of Virginia's team. Virginia is big on their tempo. They like scores, you know, really down in the low 30s. Well, so we'll and, see and how this UVA, works. obviously, very familiar with early round disappointing disappointment, losing to number 16 UMBC. Decent look. For uh, Maryland to get this game going, nice little uh, short mid-range jumper there. All right, and you got Braxton Key. Okay, no. Okay, Key Clark. He's a guy that came on late in the season. I'd like to see uh, see how he does here against uh, Anthony Cowan and company. If you're Virginia, if you're a Virginia backer, this is not what you want to see. This is the the opposite of what you want to see. You want to see that high screen. You yeah. want to see the ball flowing through the high Ooh. post. Ooh. Here we go, Cowan. Great. Oh, off the glass, Anthony Cowan it, Jr. Is this the first game that we're all on the same side, guys? I think so. I think so. I think but so. we are on the opposite side of the total, Ryan. 83 points. Love to see Cowan hit that. Take a 2-0 lead. Oh, oh steal by Cowan snap. again. Give it up. Ghost to oh, ghost, Cowan. Oh. That is a beautiful finger roll. I know it's more <laughs> exciting to see the dunk, but look at the little finger little, roll. Little Ice Gervin there, right? Yeah. Oh, man, that's an awesome poster. Look up the uh, younger kids. The kids these days won't appreciate the Iceman poster, but look that up on the YouTube. Maryland out to an early 4-0 lead. It's a mismatch there. See, that's a, see that's, they got caught in a, in a mismatch. Cowan was on the big. You don't want that if you're Maryland. You got to fix that. I expect Mark Turgeon to uh, to get that next time. And out. that's that's UVA's game. Getting Braxton Key in the paint, posting up easy points there. Here's Cowan again, going to the hole. Gets Whoa. a foul on uh, that. I believe that's going to be their big man, uh, Jay Huff. Huff, another guy, came on the second half of the season. Struggled a lot. So, someone trying to juice up their draft stock here, Cowan. Just <laughs> yeah. right away. Just There's taking always the game that over. one guy. Who has a great DJ madness skyrockets up people's big board? I'm sure we're going to be doing an NBA mock the draft. The greats of the past, <laughs> Steph Curry uh, for one. Cowan, a uh, a Maryland kid, at a Bowie. Bowie Maryland, the senior. This is the kind of guys you want to bet on in the tournament. The senior, the guard, the good ball handler makes his free throws. He has home court right now. This is who you want to load up on. Maryland out to an early five-two lead. And traditionally, Mark Turgeon has been the flaw, in my opinion. Maryland's been super talented the past couple couple years, and Turgeon was the uh, liability there. See, in a video game simulation, I, I think that <laughs> maybe that's why you play Maryland. They got a, ta- a talented roster. So now the uh, spread live over at my bookie back to four and a half, where it originally opened, closed at three and a half. So we're seeing some line movement. Total holding strong at eighty three. I'm having a feeling Kramer and I are going to sweat it out. Great defense by the Terps. Taking it another up, way, transition. Up, you got the, you got the guy underneath. Cisco with yeah. the rejection. Got to make that pass. He's wide open, man. They were two on one. Good luck. Put Stepped on the line, on the line I think. Yes, he did. But Maryland out to an eight-two lead early, and we've seen this so far. Dante Scott. There seems to be a formula with some of these simulations. One team gets out to a big lead, and then ultimately gives it up as the game goes along. DJ Madden is truly a game. They're of still runs. not switching those. You see here, they got the small on a big. This is an issue as this as the game continues to go on. Yeah, he's going to get that all day, and, and that really is their game. Braxton Key is just unguardable. Uh, there we go! Oh, 
And uh, this is looking good we, for over and for Maryland out to a 10 4 lead. We, we haven't had a dud. Hopefully, this can be a dud. We can we'll cash yeah. our tickets by halftime. Everyone can get a snack, recharge for the oh, night. Going for the match now. Oh. We have to dig, Keith Day. Oh, I thought that was. I thought that and one there. Turgeon with a smart time out there. They're not switching well. The communication defensively is a mess. Diakite. Apparently, apparently, people pointing out that Cisco is not in the game. It is Diakite. Mm. Well, again, we like to call him Cisco. <laughs> what about Wesley Snipes uh, from uh, Demolition Man? Oh yeah, you're right. The, that is a certain look. The uh, black guy with the dyed blonde hair. Wait, that wasn't you don't Cisco. See that <laughs> What is Cisco up to these days? Oh, oh. Hanging out with DMX, yeah. our boy. <laughs> Shout out to DMX. Just imagine a DMX quarantine. What is going on right now? I, I haven't <laughs> oh, seen a Jesus. ton of chatter. I, I need to know who who's on the Cavaliers here. Who's who who in their right mind would back the private school wannabes down the Tiki there Torch having in Charlottesville? Scumbag fucks. Oh, whoa, whoa! <laughs> People might be watching at home on the big screen. Colby, they got yeah. kids. Someone well, pointing out they had a bong called Wesley Pipes. That's a pretty strong <laughs> bong name. It's from Half Baked, I believe, right? Oh yeah. Uh, I mean, it sounds like it. Half Baked reference. I yeah, believe. you're right. Yeah. Maryland, Maryland CPU live oh. line over at my bookie, up to minus five and a half. Total sitting at 83. Odd even points are available, and uh, first half looks like you can still get in on the first half. Maryland first half minus two and a half. I wouldn't mind getting a little taste of that. Here we go, Cowan. Cowan player of the game right now. Great ball handling. Open three on the side. Yeah, Come had on. it, had it. Look, a lot of not much movement. You hate to see this. Okay, they're switch. Uh, whoa, what? They're letting him shoot imagine, for a reason. I would imagine that's not what Turgeon drew up on the sidelines. <laughs> <laughs> How the big man take it? Take a three. He was wide open, but you can tell that's not a part of his game. Once again, though, the switching is an issue. Okay. Pick and roll action, but Cowan oh, is man. still. Yeah, Cowan I don't like these, these matchups. And that's all day. That's just. How does I'm he really disappointed by 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 this defense that I'm seeing from the Terrapins. 18 total points already with one minute left in the first. 10 to eight, Maryland is up. One of the things you got to think here is that they got to get Jalen Smith involved. Here it is, Smith, right there. No, okay, gonna pass. Shout it out, out to Ugly but Loyal. He's back, calling people hoes. There we go. Uh, <laughs> Cowan, the Anthony Cowan, the contested layup off the glass. Maryland twelve, UVA eight. Still not impressed with that that offensive possession there. Right on schedule for the total here, Sean. Uh oh. Ooh, there we go. But it does seem in these simulations, scoring happens. Uh, late. The second half has really been where the over uh, much gets light. on a run. I don't think we've seen a charge called yet. In, nope. uh, this, in this DJ and Madness, we uh, we encourage no fouls. Wide open three. Good look. Doesn't and, rattle. And in. the total is on pace for the under. <laughs> well, Ryan, we'll see. There's still a chance to get off a shot here. No, not from back here. Oh. Decent oh. look at the three ball. First quarter ends. Maryland 12, UVA 8. Total would be on pace for 80, but the live line 83. So, well, we never cheers our Jameson guys. Cheers. There you go. You know? Salute. Well, cheers to everyone who's listening. Yeah. Enjoying DJ Madness. Hope you're out there practicing social distancing. <laughs> and we've been washing uh, your hands. How many threes have been hit? I think we're at Jesus zero Christ. threes there right we now. Are, right? Poor, uh, <laughs> poor Ekhoff over there is. He thought he was going to be cashing in. Wrong game. There was a long two where he stepped on the line. Yeah. So sorry, <laughs> sorry, Brad. Hoping, hoping some more threes hit. Maybe we'll have to double or nothing in the second half. We'll see. We'll see how he does. Hey, here we go. A little isolation. Oh. I don't know about Smith that. came in there with the foul. There was some uh, contact faking an injury here. Are, well, they gonna go, are, they going, are they going to the table? Was it flagrant? <laughs> the coach you looks like he's, Oh, come on. That's oh, it's clean. That's just hard basketball. The coach looks very odd. Like his face got, he just took a beating with a lead pipe. Like they, they didn't render his face completely. <laughs> you watch it next time. It looks pushed in. <laughs> UVA at the line down four here early second quarter action live line settling back to that four and a half Colby what does UVA need to do what do the Cavs need to do uh, keep uh, if, in my opinion just keep playing at their pace they're a good defensive team let uh, Maryland 
the Maryland's made some tough shots so far. So if they can just keep at that and then offensively, Maryland's getting really caught with these switches. I'd continue to do this. Tony Bennett, obviously out coaching Turgeon already, even though it's a video game. Shout out to Scott Mickelson on Twitter pointing out that you can parlay both games being odd. Oh, wow. that is awesome. Four and oh, of course, on the tournament. Maryland up 12 to 10, 442 left in the second quarter. And they took out Anthony Cowan Jr. Oh, fade away from Smith. I don't like that, that position. Turn into the basket. UVA on the fast break. There's your three. Settling no, for the he three. still doesn't hit. Too much size for Maryland. Okay. See, they, uh, I thought he might have walked there, but they got, they got away with it. Um, pass, great pass down low and a foul on uh, what is that? See, that's there all day for Maryland. I don't know who number eleven is because he's one of those guys who will get penetration. <laughs> Penetrated right underneath the hoop, and uh, Madden penetration right now in the championship <laughs> for the bites bracket. <laughs> Check him out. Uh, of course, bites bracket where we did a separate. Unrelated bracket, giving away five hundred dollars to the best soundbite. Uh, people filled out the brackets. The voting's still going on through the weekend, so it's not looking good for Johnny. Head over to At Gambling Podcast, but looks like Madden Penetration is gonna be the first annual winner of the Bites Bracket Tournament. Bites Bracket rolled right into DJ and Madness. Just free tournament after free tournament, giving away so much cash. What's the odd Cisco hits the game-winning shot? I feel like it's pretty good. He yeah. could be the dragon drains one from behind the arc. So Already working not, on though. my call. <laughs> yeah, because we got Maryland laying three and a half, and right now that's covering as they're up fourteen to ten. Four minutes left in the second. I remember as a senior in high school, someone did the uh, like a, a the like a, oh, nice give and go. A oh, tribute to Cisco that. in the talent show. <laughs> it's pretty awesome. Remember that the song thong to thong thong thong. Oh yeah, that video. I, I try not to remember that one. <laughs> it was a simpler time. <laughs> um, okay, look, Cowan's out of the game, guys. You got to get That's... the ball to Jalen Smith and get a lot of dribbling back in the here. Game. This is terrible. Terrible possession. Couldn't couldn't draw up a worse possession. Just dribbling for 20 seconds, settling for a deep two. Under better is just drooling right now. This is beautiful. But we've seen this through all these simulations. Oh, quick three. Oh man. How did that not go Keep in? Getting second chance points. Look, they're getting out coached. It's simply out effort, out coached. Maryland has better talent, but they should be up by more than two points here. They're actually yeah, they fortunate should. to be up by two points here. As a Maryland backer, I feel like we should be way up yeah. on this UVA team right now. Yeah, they were, this is UVA. They play defense. They stick around. They get they get hustle points. Not a bad oh. shot. Felt Maryland, like we could have got a little bit better. Maryland needs to stop the clock. Oh, what a great pass! And you feels like a timeout coming McCoy. here. Justin McCoy. UVA tying it up 14 14, 250 left here in College Park, Maryland. In a close game like this, everything has to be challenged and everything has to be earned. Don't shoot that. <laughs> <laughs> don't shoot that. I, they just need to call a timeout. Yeah, look at them. They don't they're, know what they're, they're doing smothered. offensively. They're running into each other. All right, a here you post go. Up, get, get up with it. Oh, nice. <laughs> Took a lot of effort, but great look there. Hakeem Hart Size showed difference. some heart. Look at that. Tony Bennett does look a bit odd. <laughs> he looks like uh, who's the guy who plays Rudy? Uh, Sean Aston. <laughs> That's who he Sean looks like. Aston yeah, he is coaching for the for the uh, Wahoos. He would be a private school pussy. <laughs> no one believed in his ability to coach this team. <laughs> Told him he couldn't do it. Told him he didn't. He wasn't turp material. This is a. I have moments where I completely forget we're watching a video game. That's how good some of the simulation is, the commentary, and of course the gambling action. The juices are flowing. I'm jacked up. Oh my god! Live line back down to three and a half. The total has not moved off of 83, and the first half still available minus two and a half. Listen, guys, I was five foot nothing, hundred yeah. nothing, and I made something of myself with the best football players in the land. Well, if Maryland had an entire team with half the heart of Rudiger, they'd be up by <laughs> yeah. they'd be up by 30 points yeah, right now yeah, exactly. because they do have the talent. We're just seeing the execution, the muddied offense. You're seeing the, the Tony Bennett clearly out coach Mark Turgeon yet again. He's a good coach. You know, uh, 
Bennett's been doing this the whole oh, year. Oh wow, we're seeing the uh, the fake the fake All Star voting vote. <laughs> Diakite with the inbound. And Diakite has been kind of quiet, but look at that. Okay. Okay. That not, was defended well. Not bad movement. I think that was just good defense. Maryland's right? a different team. When Here we go. Cowan's in the game. Oh, oh, come on, guys. You got you got numbers down there. Cowan, take, grab the rebound. Finish that at the rim, though. Diakite has been kind of quiet. He's the best player on this Virginia team. You would think at some point they're going to go to him. A little screw. A little, uh. Here's ABC. We'll pick and roll. Oh, Kia Clark just loses it. Great defense by Let's Maryland. Step this up. See, another thing is Virginia's getting them. You're seeing the the Maryland's a high tempo team. They haven't got much tempo going this game. Neither team looking here very good. Okay. Here you go. Give me a foul. Oh. Get okay. to the line. Get to your Kite in Darryl, foul trouble. Was that was that Morrisel? Oh, it's Dante Scott. Okay. Dante Scott heading to the line. Forward out of Philadelphia, PA. Big uh, Dante. Is it Dante? It's D O N T A. Yeah, Dante. Dante sure. Scott. I'm sure someone will correct. Dante Scott. I say Dante, but and the Dante yeah. base over here. <laughs> <laughs> Philly native at the line, looking to extend the lead to three here, 16 to 14 right now. Maryland, it's up and it's in. I love this free throw view. It, it's it, what's cool about the game is you get a different view every time with the free throw. Uh, Jalen Scott, Smith. according to Cash Juno, Scott, eighty-five percent free throw shooter. So uh, this is not the guy you want to put to the line if you're a Virginia backer or Virginia in general. But you of just course. jinxed it. You jinxed it. Well, there is the hey. announcer jinx, and we just felt that. Oh, time. he threw it off his go. head. <laughs> Double team. I don't know why he's trying to go down there to the point guard on the block. And kids watching at home, you see Clark. You see how they're only playing on half the court. They are not spacing the floor. It's way too easy. Both of these teams yeah. are being defended because they're not spacing the entire floor. Cowan. Oh, oh. wow! That Jeez, was, that the athleticism was an, of Jalen Smith. That was an ugly alley oop, but it worked. Maryland out. To a 1916 lead. Why, why don't we see that every possession? We I don't need, think Virginia has the athletes to match that. I need some more scoring from this game. Got to be honest. But the second quarter, traditionally low-scoring game for these Sims. There's 45 seconds left in the first half of basketball. All right, Kia Clark. Just, I guess they're just holding on to it. I don't <laughs> like this possession, but uh, another jumper. He can, some he can work knock in his, that uh, down. Some pivot hurts. footwork. They definitely need to work on the ball distribution. Cowan. Okay. Wow. Wow. Just trying the end one moves here. There you go. There you go. Oh, there's our first three of the game. Bradley Eckert, you just scored ten dollars, <laughs> and it's twenty-two sixteen. Needed that for the. Uh, Wait, is that a two? Because weren't they up four? For sure. No, it was nineteen sixteen. No, okay. they were up three. Troll boy twenty-four asking what round this is. This is the first round. Opening round. Wow, there's Diakite. And if you want all the info on DJ Madness, how to bet. How your brackets doing? Just go to sportsgamblingpodcast.com. Contest Cowan. Oh, oh. Love that shot. As an overbacker, I feel fine that it's forty. The, the right on. Yeah, right on the total there for eighty-three. E even at minus four and a half, I feel all right. Although I feel like they were clearly out coached in the first half. Talent will prevail. Well, and if you have the four and a half, maybe you feel a little better because right now the live line in my bookie.ag promo code SGP for up to one thousand dollars in bonus bets. Maryland minus six and a half right now on the live line total still at 83. So haven't seen enough to adjust the total. Uh, Cowan's been the player of the game. We could agree yeah. with that, right? Cowan's look great. He's he's really, he scored early, cooled off a little bit in the second half, but got it back. Got Maryland going when he's not on the floor. They struggle to have a cohesive offense. Look at this. Fast break, coast to coast. Your finger roll, George Gervin. That was a pretty. Style. That was a pretty basket. But yeah, all the replays are Cowan. Rebounding pretty similar. Uh, I mean, pretty similar stats through the entire first half. But again, it does feel like eh, they should be up by more. We, I just saw the arrows flash. The live line now down to minus five and a half, minus one twenty mm. for Maryland. Uh, and, and the main thing I want to see here is I want to see the Maryland defense learn. This is halftime. This is where you make your adjustments you and they're, and they're at home. Yeah. 
Now I know home court advantage. I think their home court was maybe rated a C. We have that's crazy because it's a it's a live it's a live place. They used to throw batteries at Duke fans. Well, maybe they needed a charge. As a guy who votes for roots for a team that's been accused of throwing batteries, also <laughs> batteries are cheap. I mean, they're not cheap. Like yeah. Who doesn't need a good battery? Yeah, who doesn't have a rock? This is one of the house. better <laughs> in home environments in college basketball. Here we go. Second half tipping off Maryland 22, UVA 18. UVA starting with the ball. They're going to go to Diakite perhaps. Diakite. Only four points in the first half. You got to think they feed they Literally feed him more. no one's moving on Virginia's offense right now. This is if we were playing rec league, I'd just be yelling, cut, cut. Kihei Clark trying to trying to get something so, going. It's a bad possession. Tough shot. Contested. He's not a one on one type of player. And here you go, Here's Cowan. Cowan, Ooh, Cowan well, is a one on one type of player. So that, he, you're seeing he, the difference. And he right here as he attacks. This. It's a foul. Wow. Did he just get punched. Colby, Come on, Colby now. again calling for fouls. <laughs> I want to see a clean game. Never guys. thought I never thought I would see the day. <laughs> Are they going to give him the shooting foul? Scott Van no, Pelt is floor. at home floor. watching the game. Just texted us saying, uh, "Go Terps." Couldn't make it because the uh, <laughs> there was a Madden tournament. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Kia Clark! Don't Man, like that three. A lot of shots. Poor um, Bradley Eckert sitting on one made three pointer so far in this game. Not great for the over. Maryland twenty four, UVA eighteen. Uh, once again, we got a mismatch here, but Cowan steals the ball. Great hands by Cowan. Oh, and he looks up. Oh, what a pass See, off the kisser. The si- off the kisser. <laughs> the simulation is smart because if that was the NBA, they would have kicked it to the open three. Much like college, making the smart decision, laying it in, getting the guaranteed two. Maryland 26, 18, 44 points. Shout out to Meat Boof in the My Bookie Twitch channel looking for some side action. Live with that look, though. You, you, you got to be happy if you're Turgeon. Oh, yeah. If you're Maryland, you love that look. Bradley Eckert. Winner of the three point contest. Love that look. He didn't love that it didn't go in, though. Here we go. Going down to Huff, who's not known Ooh. for his offense. That looked like Patrick Ewing, Colby. <laughs> mid, mid, like early 90s Patrick Ewing. Jay Huff with the fadeaway. Seven foot one forward junior out of Durham, North Carolina. I, I couldn't tell. Was that Ralph Sampson, guys? I don't, <laughs> I know, don't I, know what the hell just happened. Just there. because, like, we've gotten this comment a couple times. Do you, what do you guys think? Should we should we nix the commentators completely from the broadcast and just juice up the crowd sound? Um, yeah, you can put the maybe put the announcers down a little bit. Right, we're gonna we're gonna do that, I think. I think while the while we have twenty five seconds here in the timeout, dialing back the uh, fake announcers, bring it up some of the other. Well, sound. they just say they want more of us. Okay, yeah, give the fans what we they know, want. We know what you mean. You want the you want the atmosphere in the building. Bring the sound effects up a little bit. People love that. <laughs> there you go. There we go. All right. And we ready? That's We're ready. It. I'll skip this now. I'll tell you this though, guys. If Jay Huff is gonna continually make that shot, Maryland's got Maryland's got problems then because Jay Huff, not much of an offensive guy. And who better to give an inspiring speech than Rudy here <laughs> on the sidelines? We're gonna take we're gonna go inside. We're gonna go outside. We're gonna get him on the run. <laughs> we're gonna go, go, go. <laughs> This guy looks like he should be heading back home, working at the uh, old steel plant with his father. <laughs> oh man! Okay, what are we doing? Five seconds here. Let's speed this thing up. I'm feeling all right about the over. Forty-six total points. Two thirty left in the third. I don't feel great. Still need thirty-seven to hit the eighty-three. But I, I feel like it's possible. Here we go. Here. Interesting. They uh they took Cowan out of the game again. I hate that. <laughs> Jalen Smith. Jalen oh. Smith though has had some nice moves. Someone's got to help him out. Okay. Lost his dribble. Go back into him. Go back into him. Jalen Smith, get down in the paint, bro. They're running the offense. This is a bad possession though. Not bad look. Oh. There we go to Kia. Bradley Ekoff has got to be pulling his hair out. Not a lot of threes. Oh, ooh, that looked like a possible in one. UVA going to the line, getting some easy buckets here. I, I, okay, got him a little bit on the head. See, I will say, I, I, do, I like a little of the announcers. They inf- they inform us, you know. Dgen madness and the Dgen action. Six and a half right now is the live line. 
Look at those two midgets on the back of the bench in Maryland. <laughs> oh my God, these poor—they look like they're chemo patients. No, those, those are the guys that was were made to look like you, Sean. Oh, thank you. They, they're they five foot nine, very average. Skinheads, though. you know. Uh, oh, I didn't have time for the hair. Well, and I wanted to make it realistic. They almost look like a Beetlejuice from the Howard Stern show, a white Beetlejuice. Oh my God, those guys bit. are terrifying. <laughs> I see There's, Virginia has two too. They got twins. No, they have three right? of them. Uh, there we go. <laughs> they have two number I can fours. see it more in Charlottesville being skinheads. But oh. Oh, wow. wow, Colby. <laughs> uh oh. Here we go for three. Oh. oh. I feel so bad for them. You, you know, we, you, you know, we might have to extend this to the late game, Sean. <laughs> yeah, we might have to do something for our boy Brad. You got to credit Virginia. Their boxing out has been legit. Oh, look at the and that nice pass. That's UVA's offense, cutting to the basket, getting Cody easy looks. Statman. We're at 60 total points here. Need 23 in the third, and with one minute left. Look, they got to get Cowan in the game. Yeah. Oh, come on! You had them. You had them. Give it up. There, there you go. There we go. There you go, Big Jalen Smith. That's your shot, Jalen Smith. One foot Get dunk. The fans into it. Maryland it's a 28, life going UVA here. 24, covering, depending on where you got the number. Oh, the dude. Oh. I, I would have never thought coming into this game that Maryland would be the one giving up the second chance points. Yeah. Uh, you know, Virginia done a great job boxing out. It's really been Maryland the one that's. that's Maryland's weird because they've had moments where their defense has played well, but then just just brain lapses on boxing guys out and offensive glass and, and stuff like that. So it's, it's an interesting back and forth. Let's go in the post here. Let's go in the post. I like this. Okay. Yeah, one though. on the shot clock, Ugh. 28, Forced 26 up. Maryland up. You're going to hold for the last shot here for Virginia. Oh, he's got the guy down. Low. Yeah. I would have, I would have took the quick bus, quick basket there. I know, I know they want to hold it, but oh, man, could use a couple extra points here. Trying to hit this over. I mean, that's the best possession. That's a horrible, horrible. Thirty-five. That's the best shot you can get. Three-pointer, not good. But the action is good. The game coming down to the line again. Three quarters in. Twenty-eight to twenty-six. Maryland is up. Fifty-four points. I need twenty-nine to tie the the uh, over. Right now, the live line minus four plus one. Oh, minus three and a half if, plus one hundred. If you guys had to guess right now, I know I think one three has been made, but that's as a as both teams as a combined unit. How many threes? What are they? One for twelve, maybe? It's got. Uh, they got to be shooting like ten percent in yeah. the game. Not what Bradley well, Eckhart was looking for. And we know what that means. We could see a bit of late game regression. And I do think we're due for some late game regression, Ryan. And shout out to Justin Wood who says both these teams are trying to recruit me next season. <laughs> Best of luck with that, Justin. Appreciate you tuning in. A lot of years oh, of eligibility left. Oh, from way out. Whoa, whoa, Jeez. What was that? We talked about it, and Eric there it delivers. Maryland 31, UVA 26 off a dagger three. Oh, you got yeah, to take it. that into the back. They, they really, KA Clark's got a lot of looks this game. I don't know that that's what they wanted coming into the game, but hey, they're only down five. Oh, if we make it jumpers like Here that. Here comes the scoring. Look out. Nice mid range jumper by the Cavs, cutting it down to three. Maryland 31, UVA 28. Here's Cowan back. Glad to see they put Cowan back in the game. He should play the remainder of the game. If you're Mark Turgeon, Kite, please looking like he's to me. checking in. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go to the post. Okay. Here you go. Oh, there. Oh, oh what? Whoa. Should have took take the jumper <laughs> there. Whoa. You're outside. You got given up a bunch of size. You're a grown man. Take Have it to the basket. Have not been too impressed with my my Maryland to win it all projection. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, this horrible wow. defense. Wow. Come on, guys. Great run here for over backers. We're back in it. 61 points. Only need. 22. What? All right, let's talk about this for a second. What just happened? My CPU is a neural net processor, a learning <laughs> computer. Clearly, they know that Mark Turgeon's a shit coach. They know more than we're giving them credit for. Yeah. Maryland minus three now. It's down to minus three plus 100. I still like that. I'm sitting on a Maryland minus four and a half. And of course, the over. I still feel good. I still feel Maryland's going to get ready to extend this, but. Every time they're going on run, UVA answers. I I think home court will prevail. 
Uh, we'll help them push it over. At Jamie Hove uh, 49, these games have been great. They also taught me that I'm as bad as betting computers as I am humans. Oh, <laughs> don't be down. Yeah. You should, Jamie, you should have listened to my picks. Yeah, I'm three on and one the right now. Week one picks podcast. <laughs> yeah, three and one. Oh, what? Miami Heat. Interesting. Yeah, they like to, uh, to uh, <laughs> promote the. Uh, Look, Callan, the, they said the Heat scouts are in the house. 22 so Tricky <laughs> pointing out the CPU wants every game to be closed into the final minute. Trust me, I've watched a lot of these. Not the case. Blowouts not happening. Come on, Callan. Oh, oh, my man. Goodness. He tries a spin move. Oh, uh, come on now. You got to be smarter than that. Kia Clark, look down low for the dunk. UVA oh, takes. Braxton Key. Is that the first lead? First lead it for is. UVA, 32 31. Maryland, settle down. Keep getting good looks. Get the ball in Cowan's hands. Let him create. Give it up. Give it up. You got a big on a small. You got Kia Clark on a small. Go, Go to it. Good matchup. Go to it. He you don't kid. need to do that. You don't mm. need to do that. I, I like the move. He just he could have got it. I think to back he got a little closer. Back yeah. all the way to the basket. <laughs> I mean, they, everyone knows it's DJ madness. We're just getting overtime again. <laughs> Guys, I'm really sweating my bracket. I don't even care about my minus four and a half. <laughs> oh, oh my, my gosh. gosh. Just lazy defense by the Terrapins. He's one of those guys who will get penetration. I mean, you look at Virginia is just hyper oh, efficient Come on, right Cowan, now. right here. That's two points. There you Anthony go. Anthony Cowan. Cowan responds, 67 total points. The bench of UVA outscoring yep. the Terps by 11. That feels like the storyline right here. And this is not a deep Virginia team, so that's somewhat surprising. Lock down, everyone get on the ball. You know, like this, this is this under's locked in, Sean. Yeah, it's not looking good, especially uh, when they're once again taking the a whole switch possession. Got Diakite on Cowan, but Clark shoots a three. Diakite on wow. Cowan. That's a great mismatch. That's why this. You this, have to box out. No, yeah, that was Maryland just fumbling on the fundamentals. No, they did. They switched again, and that's a mismatch, and that's going to be an issue all game. And just give it to Cowan. 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 Oh. Oh. Motherfucker. And a shout out to Johnny Mac watching on YouTube. I'm not I'm unclear what he's talking about. This is real life, bro. These games are real. <laughs> it's still real to me, Dan. Our is, boy Callan at the line. That's what we want to see. Crowd's not really lively. I don't know what they did here, but this this should be a live crowd. I've been in this stadium before. Normally a very electric it's uh, it's time. atmosphere. It's they, time. they need to get their shit together mentally. Time for them to get it up. <laughs> Ryan, I'm already rooting. We got to get our shit going mentally for Maryland for uh, this game to go in overtime with one. Wow, left. you don't think we can do it? Oh, I think oh. we can do it. And tell me, it's gonna be five and zero oh with dogs. <laughs> no, it's not possible. The un the under could win for the first time. Anything is possible in DJ Madness. Park, go, oh. Huge possession here for the UVA. Day. Gives it up to Huff. Is Huff going to go solo? This is the guy you would want the ball with last if you're a Virginia fan, but he passes it to Clark. Great wow. cut to the oh, rim. Oh, man. Great find. A, Tony a Bennett. Tale of two halves for this Virginia Cavalier team. They came out and just didn't look like they wanted to be on the court. Uh, Maryland hasn't been impressive oh, at all. Three's open. At all. Cowan. Oh. Jeez. And that easy. finger roll. We love it. That 75 points. Only need eight more for the total. Hey, 14 minutes, 14 points. How about you keep him in the game the whole game? <laughs> All right. I, I do think that Virginia needs to change the strategy when it came comes to defending him. They, on appear, the to, they appear to have no strategy. This is another one coming down. Huff, big for three. Man for three. What? Oh, what? Jimmy Huff. Huff. oh my Bradley. God! What am I witnessing here? Bradley Eckert's got to be loving that. Seventy-eight <laughs> points. We only need six more to hit. Jay the Huff over. hasn't hit a three. Since he was a nine year old. Unbelievable. Clo closing. Wow. Closing with a 15 to 6 run for the U University of Virginia Cavaliers. Did not see this, especially in Maryland, on Maryland's home court. Crazy. Road teams have done well in DJ Madness. My brackets. It's screwed, guys. You, know what I mean? <laughs> you want to check on your bracket? Go to sportsgamblingpodcast.com. That, that, that's the most real feeling thing about this is that feeling of defeat. I just lost my bracket with my guy who's never shot a three in his life. Do you think it's three. over? Uh, well, to win, yes, yes, yeah. I think it's over. Well, I had UNC win in game one, and they came dangerously <laughs> close because uh, I was really kind of going for it in my bracket. I, you know, it's, three. 
Oh no, sorry, that was. Uh, yeah, he's had some. He's had some. Uh, he's some Kobe, Kobe, Kobe off him out. Oh. Kihei Clark. Kihei Clark. He hate me, Kihei Clark. <laughs> All right, let's get a quick basket here, guys. Uh, oh, I hate shoot this. Shoot that. I hate this. Get it you the in, you pass Fuck the ball it. for 45 seconds. This Screen. is not good. Give it up. I don't even care about my bet here. We get a stop. The, we're going to get the ball back. 11 seconds left. Don't let Jay Huff hit a three. What a game here. College Park, Maryland. Look. DJ Madness hits again, guys. Kramer, it's, uh, the feed's looking like it's getting a little laggy. So, just a heads up. Okay. The engineers are looking at it as we speak. Everything looks good on our end. If you if you have issues, you can always go to mybookie.ag, see the mybookie Twitch feed. They got the betting line right underneath there. Maryland right now a pick at plus 170. Are you kidding me? They're only down one. What? And they got Anthony Cow. They got the best player on the court. All right, if they can play defense, which I question because they've been a mess defensively all game. But if they can get play if I'm turging, I'm saying, guys, you got 24 seconds to play the best defense of your life. And then after that, you're gonna make Anthony give the ball to Anthony Cowan. Let the best man win. Let's go. Here we go. go no in. need to foul. No need to foul. Just play your D. Box out. Box out. Oh, oh, gives up. Gives up a. He, he could have made a layup there. They're, but they're getting cute. Yeah. Kia Clark for the jumper. Ooh. Misses. Jalen wow. Smith with the board and the timeout. He, they could have. Oh my God! So this means this is gonna come. To, the total is gonna come down to this last shot. Hit it, and it goes over or pushes. My bracket's coming down to this last shot. <laughs> <All right. laughs> if you're if you're UVA and you're catching those points, you gotta feel great unless there is a foul that sends it to overtime. I mean, right now, if you're charging, you got to think what there's only two. Obviously, I would say Cowan, but Virginia's going to know that they're going to go to Cowan. So I'd expect some double teaming perhaps. But uh, then you got to think Jalen Smith, get the ball into Jalen Smith. Colby as a backer of Maryland minus three and a half, four and a half, whatever <laughs> you have. have. Are you rooting for this game to go to overtime or are you rooting for your bracket? I'm going to stay for the alive? bracket. Okay. I'm going for the bracket at this point. I'll take a loss. I want some cash. I'm three and one so far in the tournament. I can, I can afford a loss. Serious question though, guys, I, again, I've seen a lot of these. How is everyone coming down to the wire? This is ridiculous. It's insane. It is DJ madness. Coach Kevin po pointing out that uh, since it's the NBA rules, Maryland will advance it. Uh, and they did well, 17 seconds. left. So doesn't really matter anyway. Did they um, hold for the last get shot. Get the ball in your best player's yeah. hand. Get it to Cowan. Get it to Cowan. Get it to Cowan. Uh, here we go. They're Cowan going to posting it. up Cowan. The double team is there. Jalen Smith Ooh, doesn't want the ball. He in his was hands. wide open. Hit it for, for three. three. Fade away. Oh, those oh, bumps. Oh, are you kidding me? Why would are you kidding me? Oh. A fade away. Just a Mark Turgeon. You, you bum. Brutal. Mark Turgeon's wow. a bum. Wow. That was horrible. There goes my. I mean, Dude, I only. They pass it to Jalen Smith. He's wide open, and he they he hot potatoes it. Oh, uh, how do you not get Cal in the ball there to end the game? You know what? I'd like to formally apologize on behalf of Sean Colby and myself. I knew this was going to happen when we all agreed, <laughs> and we're going to agree later. I think too. Nope, not true. You take it with your thoughts. Oh, okay. Look, I love a good shocker. So All right, let's take a look at the let's take a look at the old box. Look at score. this three point shooting. What? All right, four of what? Sixteen. Sean, I'm making an executive decision. We are going to extend the contest through the night game. All right, Bradley, you're lucky. We really want to get you paid. Only four made three pointers this time. We're running it back. Uh, so stay tuned for the late game tipping off very shortly. Ten minutes, seven o'clock Pacific. 10 o'clock East, and we got a uh, great matchup. Of course, you can stream it live on all our feeds. Wichita State getting six and a half points in San Diego, facing off against our gals. Total sitting at 83 and a half. Odd and even uh, points available to bet that. Odd points, five and oh, right now. Five and oh, betting the odd total Under points. Five was that? Yeah. No, the over the over lost its first match. Yes, no, I mean I'm sorry. Uh, uh, underdogs. Uh, yes. 5 and 0, yeah. Under dogs are five and zero. Oh. Perfect situation for a contest. Dogs also four and one straight up. Yeah. So it feels like 
there's going to be some chalk late, but again, this is a computer simulation. We are betting on video games because hashtag Degens only. Guys, tweet us at Gambling Podcast. Hashtag Degens only. Show us your setup. Show us what you're working on. Show us what you're drinking. Show us how you're celebrating DGen madness. We're going to uh, take a quick break and be back with the late game here on the Sports Gambling Podcast.